Hi, it's Eddie and welcome to the channel. Today I wanted to make a short video showing how to get Isotope RX11 working in DaVinci Resolve. So first what you have to do is you come to DaVinci Resolve menu, preferences, audio plugins and OK. I have it already here, but you click add and then you click on this patch section here and it will open. So this one is only for Windows. And from here you can see the path, this PC, Windows, Program Files, Isotope, RX11 Audio Editor and Win64. And you click this Isotope RX11 Audio Editor dot X and it will add it here. I remove this new extension here. Next thing what you have to do is, this is now on edit page, you come to Fairlight page and you add RX Connect to here. Let me do it again. You find it from Restoration, VSTs and RX11 Connect. Click that one. You can close this one, no problem. I put it to be first there. And now you can you right click external audio process and you choose RX11. Remember now that when you do these changes here. By default, this one don't have this name, so you have to give it a name. And after you have added this one to here, you have to restart DaVinci Resolve. Anyway, now we can go here, RX11, and now it opens the event. But what I have seen in my case, I show you what it does. So if I, example, want to de-click and I run this, I render this here. Now when I save it, I press Ctrl S, it will save it and it will save it also to resolve. As you can see, now it's there. You can see it even in here, in this clip, clip name, so it is edited. But now, for some reason, if I want to continue, I come here, I want, example, to put the crackle, I run this, it will go perfectly fine. But now, if I try to save this, it gives this, the current file cannot be saved. Please make sure it's not open in other application and try again. So what to do now then? What to do is that you close the RX and you start the process all over again. So here is the crackle. And now when we click Ctrl S, it will save it, just like this. So, a little bit tricky, but it's working. I hope you liked the video. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.